Hey, this is Rich Knapp with OxyHeli. Today I come to you, we're going to discuss head maintenance. Now, once you build your kit, there is a little bit of a break-in period because your, uh, your uh, dampers and that uh, rubber o-ring behind the damper, they start to compress. Now, around the 20, you know, depending on your fly style, around the 20 flight to 50 flight area, um, it's very good to periodically check if you grab your grips and if you have any play this way if you have any play it's time to go ahead and take your blades off remove your grips and add an additional spacer on each side uh, on uh, the main uh, the spindle shaft then uh, go ahead and reinstall your grips without Loctite and keep checking until there is no side play, rocking play. The Oxy head is actually designed to be ran with a little bit of preload just sitting still like this. So, uh, you know, you're not looking for any, you know, vertical play. And if you have any rocking play, you want to go ahead and shim that. It generally starts around, you know, if you're a really super hard smack flyer, around 20 flights. But it can be anywhere from 20 flights to 50 flights. Because what happens is that black o-ring that you installed behind the damper, it compresses. Once you do shim it out and it's tight, you should be good for the rest of the flight until you crash again. Because that... Uh, rubber o-ring is already fully compressed to the point where it's not going to compress anymore um, so check that out make sure you make that one of your inspections post flight or pre-flight so you know when it's time to do your maintenance and to go ahead and shim it for proper operation of the helicopter thank you very much happy flying